Hello ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another video of the brand split, the blue brand. We are here with Charles. Hello. And are you ready for another great episode of Smackdown Live? I, I don't think it's going to beat Raw this time. Yeah. I think Raw we're going to go tied good. into Smackdown, into Raw. SummerSlam. Raw was pretty good. This is the SummerSlam go home show. Yeah. So, sh should, we get, should we get into it? Yep. Yeah. All right. In our first of two pre-show matches today, in a 53 D plus, Chris Sabin defeats Tyler Breeze with a cradle shot. Cool. And in our second pre-show match, 56 C minus, the Usos defeat the Ford villains. Yeah, blah blah. Jimmy is the better performer out of the Usos. Hmm. Next segment. We start off the show with a 90A. It's basically the show opening video, blah, blah, blah. You know, you know, the classic. Yeah. Next segment. In a 63C, we see the debut of the Rockstar Club winning against American Alpha in 716 when Heath Slater defeated Chad Gable by pinfall of a slingshot called Screw Splash, following interference from Aiden English. During the match, we also had Simon Gotch running and attack Jason Jordan. Ooh, interesting. Rockstar Club. Rockstar Club. Rockstar Club. Yeah. Oh, Brian. Daniel Bryan books the main event, which is John Cena and Dean Ambrose versus AJ Styles and our Intercontinental Champion, The Miz. Interesting, interesting. 88B+, plus. that's that's our main event for Go Home Show. Next segment. In a 49D+, plus, in about a decent, rea uh, decent reaction from the crowd, but sub far wrestling, Baron Corbin defeated Kalisto in 902 by Pitchfork at end of days. Hmm. Yeah, not bad. Let's Big just, guy versus the little guy match. Let's hmm. just say both of these are mid-carders. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, your mid card is meh. Yeah, it's very meh. Very meh. Next segment, 45D. That's our last match is booked in for SummerSlam. Jeez, we've got such a large card. About 15 matches booked. Yeah. And it's what teams? It's American Alpha versus Ford Villains. Say if this is probably going to go on a pre-show, but whatever. Probably. Next segment. Uh, B minus 73. Samoa Joe defeated Zack Ryder in 1018 by pinfall and mus muscle buster during the match. We also had the Miz running and attack Ryder. How could he? Mm. Decent Next. match, actually. Next segment. After finding out that he will have to stop teaming with Zack Ryder, Mojo Rawley has been looking for a partner for the past week and he's found Apollo Crews. <laughs> Hype bros mark two. Oh no. You know the brothers of distraction? Dis destruction? Now we've got the brothers of hype. The brothers of hype. <laughs> yep. Okay. And I'm they, digging it. And they lose the first match against Harper and Rowan in the 15 C minus. <laughs> In the poor match, Harper and Rowan defeat Brothers of Hype in five in six fifty nine when Luke Harper defeated Mojo Rawley by pinfall with discus clothesline. Mojo Rawley was the weak link. Apollo, I think you're probably better without Mojo. <laughs> no surprise there. <laughs> Next segment eighty four B plus. Wyatt warns Orton about that um, if he is going to go through with this match at SummerSlam. He may never wrestle again. He may never be the same man again. Because once you go in the ring with the face of fear, you don't come out the same. Mm. Next segment. 77 B minus. About I've had good wrestling and decent reaction from the crowd. Bray Wyatt, um, Alberto Dario, Rhino, and Sa uh, Damien Sandow. Defeated Randy Orton, Dolph Ziggler, Shelton, Benjamin, and Shinsuke Nakamura. And Bray Wyatt defeats Shelton Benjamin with a sister Abigail. So it's an alright match. Yeah, not bad. That was our semi-main event. Next segment, 
in a 100-day star, John Cena had an interview hyping up his singles match with AJ Styles. Just classic Cena, you know? Yeah, classic Cena. Next segment, in the cool-down match in the 45D, Alex Shelley defeated Victor in 2-24 by pinfall before the city stretch. Uh, they didn't click, but that's alright. At, all, right. at all, but it's a, it's a cool-down match. Brought the fans back down a little. Then we have a 76B minus. AJ Styles has an interview in which he taunts John Cena. Um, next segment. Our main event gets a 79B. If I had super wrestling and great heat, why did it get only a 78B, a 79B then? Oh, psychology. <laughs> Dean Ambrose yes, and John Cena defeated AJ Styles uh, and The Miz in 2051 when John Cena defeated The Miz by pinfall of it. Attitude adjustment. Not bad, not bad. Final and segment. end the show. 88B plus. Ziggler, Del Rio, and Ambrose stared at him. End the show. Ooh. Oh, Ooh, dear. Ooh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Well, that wasn't good. I swear to God it didn't sh- It actually didn't show me the percentage. Yeah, I saw it at the beginning. Did you? I, I didn't tell you. God, why? It's a war, man. Come on. Well, it's it's two all. I don't care. I'm gonna I'm two gonna, all. I'm gonna win. I, and you're gonna count them both to little mistakes. Yeah. Whatever. It, pr- even if that show had the full rating, it it wasn't gonna beat Raw. No, it wasn't gonna beat Raw. The Puerto it, Rico it's like it in real Raw, life. But... Sorry, mate. Like in real life. I'm sorry, but, you know, it's 2 all. I was in the lead. 2 all. We're going into Raw. Into Just because you got one fight. lucky Raw doesn't mean anything. It wasn't a lucky Raw. It was a it lucky was Raw. It was to per- perfection. <laughs> lucky Raw. We'll see. I've got the main event for SummerSlam. So. It doesn't matter. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe to me and Charles. And get hyped for SummerSlam. Yep.